Alright, so this is the second half of the way. Let's see who this one is. Yeah, and it looks like it's the Insecticon. Generic Insecticon. Let's see what we have there. there. Looks very simple. Here's the Creo block. Legs always like this for whatever freaking reason. Here's and this is a pretty spiffy chest. It's that type of gun symbol right there. Very very nice. And here's the vest. Right there. Let me put this gray piece on here. Get this on here. Let me get this. It looks like a bike. Let me put it on here. Mm. Oh, that has the head stuck on backwards. It's freaking fantastic. Let's see. And there's the head. Very nice head. And this is a. Uh, I think this is a helmet they use for Mirage. It's very nice. And you have some insect legs on either side. His arms, which are pretty loose when you get them on there. They're very loose. And then, same thing we had with Ravage with this um, sword tail thing. You have it on there. That's pretty spiffy. And well, to go to the um, bug mode, you just take off the head and take and reattach the the legs. It looks like you. Yeah, you turn this around, then you take the legs, the insect legs, and when you get the damn things off, you just slide or snap them on there and get the arms to be the other set. And then you just twist. Like around, you attach this on, and you attach this piece on, make like a bug head, and then you attach the head on here, not the head, the sword. Then it's like, and there's the bug mode. And here's the next one. Which is the, um, we'll get that glare off. Blast off. Which is pretty cool. I always like Bruticus. Like, he was one of my first combiners, actually, because I got the Robots in Disguise version of the Ruination. You know, it's pretty spiffy. There's Creo. There's legs. And here's the chest. It's pretty detailed, very nicely detailed. And then he has the backpack, Lego. Oops, leg, uh, Creo. Cough, cough. And then 
Ooh, wow, this is interesting. It looks like you can attach these things here to like simulate a know, rocket feet, perhaps. You got the little wing dealios. You can put on the side here. Get these arms out. The rockets it's on. Oh, geez, if I can get these on. It's like, I don't know. I can't get this one fully in. It's very tight. So there's my crap job, and it's the same thing, the weapon's the same thing as, um, Quicksilver, not Quicksilver, it's like, you get this, and then you get the flight thing on, and then you get the actual gun in here to put in, to make it a bigger flight gun thing. If I can get it in there. And in the back, in the back, and put this on. Then you get this nice face, pretty spiffy black face on here. Then you get another Mirage face, and I don't know, I think they could have used like a different head for this, but uh, whatever. So let's see where this goes. Alright, so get the these bits down here to emulate the rocket flares you separate this this is way tighter than the one in Quicksilver and so you put this oh you put this in the middle at an angle I guess and then you put it centered and then you move well, put this down a tab then you connect this one down to cover the waist so you to make it more shuttly I don't know, you can put this on the side if you wanted. But basically, this is the jet, the space rocket. <laughs> Alright, so, here's Blast Off. And here's the next one. And it's also a combiner member, this time it's Huck. Very nice. It's very struck on palette. And let's look at the chest design. And this is very nice. Very construction vehicle like. And here's the vest, which just completely covers this all up. Which is whatever. And then we get wheels again, except these bigger wheels. No, no, I think they're the same size. Just very thick wheels. Get these on. And on the back, get put this on. Put this on. Then you attach this part on. Oof. 
Let me attach this part on. Then you get this nice shade, orange shades on. You get this very angular flat top helmet on. It's very nice. Here is hook, and here it is with this little gun. Looks very nice. You get the empty to focus. It's very nice. So change it to his robot. Uh, vehicle mode is simple. You detach, you detach the entire thing. Then you move these forward and then attach the front tires on. Get this center. And then you would you attach this right here on the leg. Oh shit! All right, wait a minute. Okay, I got it. I got it back. I got it back. Okay. So now I'm gonna try to attach this without losing the damn thing again. Okay, so there it is. And then you attach this entire crane joint on here. And now you have the vehicle mode. And you can even you can even have the gun here, but it's loose, so you just put it on here. Then you get crane. Ta da! And here's this one. And he is the third. One, two, three, yeah, the fourth, he's the fourth, um, jet, air, vehicle, and he is third, part of the Conehead Trio, the Seekers, this is very nice, whoa, 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 now you get his, that, and you get, very nice seeker as with the cockpit and the nipple thrusters. Then you have to cover the damn thing up so you can get the wings on. Get the Kriya out. So for the backpack, you attach this and then you attach the wings. Very nice. Very wide span then you get the head on the right way you know, very nice very nice angry face and you get this very nice cone head and you get these little things on the side as always if you can get them on there Try to get the other damn one on. And you get this back on. And then these things, the no way blasters, you can just attach here. This is very nice. Very nice. And so, well, with transformation to vehicle mode, jet mode is very easy. Just flip the position of the cannons so they face up get these arms in as you can and then there we go here's the jet mode um 
So, and here you can see how they don't really include stickers for paint apps because you see the cockpit is completely blue. So whatever, still pretty cool. And then here is the second to last. And the only female and the only prime figure in this wave. Here is Arachnid, also the second one of the beast mode, which is very eh. So let's get this one going on. Let's get the, get the nice creel block here. Legs straight. And this, this is very nice. This has become symbol like uh, the spider right here. But then you have to cover it up. This, the very military vest. And then. They, well, she also gets Nullway blasters for some reason. But in purple. Very stylish. You can use it for. Oh, slipstream. You can make a custom slipstream. And you can get. Ooh. Get this on here. There you go. Then you get. These two motorcycle dealios, dealios on here. Like then it's a very nice spider leg. You get to Okay, I got these on wrong, I guess. I don't know. These aren't the freaking best to get. <sighs> okay, what the fuck ever. Get this, this very female goth death face. With her very nice helmet. Oh, here, so I'm gonna the... all right, I guess I have to put this on anyway for the arachnid mode though it doesn't really look that great because it looks like you have to put this at an angle where it's not even really set because it'll pop out any moment holy shit I mean, like, seriously? In case the, f the fuck. And so, the no worry blasters would be uh, facing here, and it's like. Uh, it's a. Uh, spider. I don't know. And here is the final. The final guy in a. Uh, <laughs> ah. And it's the old school G1 comics. Decepticon Bludgeon. Very nice. He is the second tank after Gerald Warpath over here. And he looks like, yeah, he's the only pretender out of this bunch. Very nice. Very nice details. Just have to cover that out with this. So,
just because you can get cannon on here. You would attach the barrel. Um, I did it the wrong way. So you can get the effing barrel. However you want, because it goes right through it. Then you can get the attached here. Then the good old katana. His weapon of choice right here. And his very nice skeleton head. Plucked here with another Megatron, uh, Prime Megatron y head. Very nice. Very nice. So basically, it's the same uh, thing as Warpath. Get the things down here. Get the thing lined up. You twist the. Actually, first off, first off. Take out the weapon, switch this, turn these around. That's my phone. Then you turn the turret, turn the turret, turn the effing turret. And then you have his whittle, his whittle tank mode, his little pretender tank mode. So, yeah. Alright, so this first wave of figures, um, was very very good for the first wave besides the preview wave which I never got ranging from combiner parts of the finish triple changers uh, turbo masters autobots tanks cone heads pretenders primes very nice again